Hi guys, it's Connor from the Strength Factory and today we're going to talk about staying on track with your nutrition with zero planning. So I'm talking no meal spread, dinner out, lunch out, it works. Right, so let's get started. So, first thing we're going to talk today is what my nutritional goals would be um, on an average day, um, how I would get through that, which would be nothing planned and I will run through it. So, firstly, I'm going to go for 200 and 20 grams of protein. We'll aim for 200 grams of carbs, and then we'll go for around 70 grams of fat. Okay, how I'm going to work that out on the day is I'm going to use the app My Fitness Pal. Probably the best app out there for tracking your food. Pretty much this massive database of uh, nutrition, whether it be in restaurants. Test when you start to like it. So I recommend you get that if you stay on track. Right, so to get to these goals, let's start at breakfast. Right, breakfast. So a few things I like to, like to have at breakfast on the bacon before we start there. I'm gonna give myself, let's say, three slices of bacon. Let's go for two eggs and 75 grams of porridge. We'll make that with water just to keep calories down. Okay. Now we'll move on to lunch. So for lunch, we've got nothing planned. What I'm going to do, I'm going to stop off at Subway, while it's nearby. Um, and I'll pick something relatively healthy, so let's go for chicken and salad. So I'm going to go for a chicken teriyaki salad. I'm going to get double meat just to stuff the protein. It can be relatively low protein for lunch. On top of that, I'm going to chuck in just a, a standard size apple from anywhere. Okay, so that's lunch. Next meal is going to be, I'll tell you what, we're going to trade. Let's have a trade now. Next meal will be portable cake. So we'll go for two scoops. Way. And let's say we just have some orange juice available for some carbs. Go for orange juice. About 150 millions, small glass. Right, that's post workout, next meal. We'll go for our evening meal, D, dinner, tea, whatever you want to call it. Let's say, let's make it really interesting. Let's go, let's go for a Nando's for this one. Right, we can still track the Nando's. All in this app, full database of all the nutritional info, nothing to worry about there. So, Nando's, let's get some help here for butterfly chicken. Butterfly, let's get some macho peas. And some spicy rice, that's good for that. I'm gonna stay away from the chips. Right. So, four five match up your spice of rice, perfect. Let's just get some water or a diet coke, or something like that. Right, and the next meal after that, let's call it our evening meal just before we go to bed. So, last one, evening meal. Right, we need to uh, hit a bit more protein, a bit more carbs. So, we'll go for 225 grams of uh, strawberry yogurt. And then we'll put the strawberries with some actual strawberries and go on to the grounds. Okay. So there's my day, no planning, two meals out. Nice, he's made the right choices. And what that comes to would be around 30, 225 grams of road nut curds. Around 190 to 195, and then your fats were around 65 grams. So, as you can see, we're only 5 grams out of our protein goal, we're only 10, 5 10 grams out of our carb goal, and the fats were only 5 grams out. Not bad for having no plan whatsoever, no meal prep, just buying these good ones. And that's how you stay on track with zero plan. Enjoy.